Let's go leave it in here. Yeah, this is the start of it, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. Just go stop a second, Stu. I need to jump off. Yep. Alright, not a second. Cattle grid just here. Oh, yeah, there's. Ah, look, look at this one. It's, there's a V8 in it. Yeah. Dry up here as well. Oh dear. So false neutral. <laughs> you okay? Yeah, yeah, fine, yeah. Absolutely massive. Two of them, one after. In fact, this one looks bigger than the last one, doesn't it? Yeah. So to see which one is bigger. Well, this one definitely looks bigger. So it definitely looks like it's low, doesn't it? Yeah, it's very low. Right? Uh, what's going on here? It's an actual sign. Yeah, it's a sign, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Camp as well. I'm guessing you'd have to come to that from the direction we're travelling. You know. Yeah, yeah, I thought so. If Chris and uh, Mark know about that. Yeah. Sheep here, look right. Another parking area here, see. It's a viewing point, Pat. God, I wish we had more time. <laughs> that's that's this reservoir, isn't it, Megan? A house. This poor little tree. <laughs> Oh dear me. Camping! Yeah. Yeah, the thing is you can camp anywhere though, can't you? Yeah. Scotland. Chris was telling me last night that 
currently the laws, uh, the way the law is, in Scotland, is you can't take somebody's front yard, there's nothing you can do about it. <laughs> the only thing you can do is bring the police and then the police are like nothing to do, but you don't have to camp anywhere. Is that another one the other side here? You know, it looks like it, doesn't it? Some more. Here we are, here. Careful there, Tony. Uh, yeah. Well done. Oh, if that were in front of us, well, I'm guessing because we're we're only 1.8 miles to the main road, so that one. I'm guessing he's St. Mervyn's Lock. Yeah. 